Hi, in this video, I will talk about the best RPG games that everyone should play, and I'll start with Bannerlord. This is an RPG with strategy elements in the medieval world. Having chosen the backstory and origin of the character, you go to a cruel world where the hero's family will be killed in the first minutes, and the country, in which it is easy to recognize the Roman Empire, is in a state of civil war between lords, nomads, and mercenaries. Here is a huge world that will take a long time to explore. In its open spaces, you can engage in many activities typical of the genre. For example, recruit volunteers for your own army and seize foreign lands, participating in large-scale battles and sieges in order to rule several cities in the status of a lord or king. You can rob caravans, get married and have children, trade and master realistic combat mechanics. Dragon Age Origins, the first part of the Dragon Age game series, received a huge number of awards, was enthusiastically received by critics and remembered by the players as the most comfortable part of the saga, with deeply developed characters, an exciting plot and a competent combat system. In the process of passing, we have to make various decisions that will affect the game world and the plot. Relationships with companions play an important role. Having met any hero, you can take him to the squad or ignore him. The game has stood the test of time and is still a joy to play even today. Fallout New Vegas Here, just a few hours after the start, we will be left alone with everything that you love so much in RPG, exploring the open world and interacting with the characters living in it. This game will delight you with a large world, numerous factions waging war with each other, an exciting storyline and a sea of side quests that will take dozens of hours to complete. There are also ample opportunities for developing your character, a large number of weapons and unique companions. Divinity 2 Ego Draconis. The game differs from other similar projects with a rich plot dedicated to the war against dragons in a fantasy world. The protagonist is one of the dragon hunters, over time gaining the ability to turn into a dragon. In addition to an interesting non-linear plot, the game is able to please with a large number of quests, an unusual crafting system based on the use of parts of killed enemies, an impressive number of items of equipment, both for humans and dragons, the ability to create a suitable pet, and a host of other unusual mechanic features. Kingdom Come Deliverance This is the most realistic medieval RPG without magic and monsters, where we can become anything from a vagabond to a knight. Here we are waiting for a non-linear story that tries to be historically accurate, a large open world with endless fields and castles, as well as complex fencing-based combat mechanics that not everyone will like. At any time, you can digress from the main storyline and do something else, trade, clear out bandit camps, join the local thieves' guild, and so on. Gothic 2. If we are talking about truly iconic RPGs, then one of the most atmospheric games of the early 21st century, Gothic, simply cannot be ignored. The second part of the franchise took a step in the right direction and to this day is considered the best in the series, especially when viewed in conjunction with the addition of Knight of the Raven. The developers managed to create, albeit a small, but quite coherent and well-designed world with a huge number of tasks, an entertaining role-playing system and complete freedom of action. Fable. This game immerses us in the story of a boy who has yet to choose his own path, and we will help him in this. A distinctive feature of the game was the emphasis on the personalization of the hero. Almost all actions in the game affect not only the plot, but also the development of the features of the protagonist. Literally everything influences how he looks, what he eats, what decisions he makes, and what he uses in battle. Every time a player spends skill points, their character gets older, and the karma system eventually renders the character's true self. The Legend of Zelda The main hit of the Nintendo Switch and simply an RPG that should not be missed in any case. On the technical side, Zelda is not the most advanced game, but its world is beautiful, diverse, and full of details. Here no one will lead you by the hand, nowhere you will run into invisible walls go to all four sides on horseback or a hang glider, take on any of a lot of side quests that are often even more interesting than the main plot. Look for rare items, 
craft equipment, and meet the amazing people of Hyrule. Greedfall. This RPG offers us to move to a mysterious island. According to the plot, the protagonist arrives here to search for a cure for the plague, which is gradually destroying the world. However, everything is not so simple, because the lands are inhabited by many amazing creatures and factions with which you will have to negotiate. Greedfall is a project that invites you to explore a fantasy universe and make difficult decisions. The choice of the player will directly affect the open world. The Witcher 3. This is the best role-playing game of recent years and you cannot miss it. A branch plot, dozens of deeply developed characters, hundreds of various opponents, convenient combat mechanics, and all this in the scenery of a bewitchingly beautiful fantasy world. Surprisingly, CD Projekt Red managed to fill the game with content, avoiding typical RPG quests like. Each task has a goal and a reward, a story to understand, and even the smallest one can take you a lot of time. Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen, an RPG about dragons, with dark gothic locations, frightening bosses, and creepy creatures. There is a large selection of equipment, and a large number of combat techniques. There is also one important innovation that has never been used anywhere, and by anyone before, a unique system of satellites, here called pawns. Players can not only use the services of the local hired magicians and warriors, but also call on the pawns of other players, giving them unnecessary equipment, as a reward. Cyberpunk, action RPG from the creators of the Witcher series. A sensational action movie that offers an unforgettable adventure in a futuristic night city where the main character, by coincidence, turns out to be the receptacle of the consciousness of a deceased rock star. The game will immerse us in the world of cyberpunk, in which we are waiting for shootouts, chases, dozens of interesting characters and several storylines, as well as cyber implants that allow you to create different builds, from a deadly killing machine to a stealthy burglar capable of killing enemies through a neural interface. Tales of Arise. As is often the case in the Tales of series, two planets serve as the scene of action at once Dana and Rena. At the beginning of the game, the Renian have been holding the inhabitants of Dana in slavery for 300 years, exploiting them for their own purposes. The plot begins with the story of one of the slaves, who does not remember anything about his past. However, one day everything changes. The story itself does not shine with originality, the heroes are going to destroy the six villains who in every possible way mock the people. However, this is more than offset by the elaboration of characters, plot twists, and a variety of interesting situations. In addition, each arch here offers something new. Deus Ex a series of first-person shooter RPGs set in a cyberpunk setting that players love in large part due to the non-linear gameplay. It was based on a complex device and high interactivity of the levels, as well as the presence of a well-thought-out role-playing system that allows you to create your own style of passing and fits well into the general surroundings. We are talking about the so-called system of augmentations, high-tech implants and prostheses, giving the hero various passive and active skills. Selected and installed augmentations can then be improved, increasing their effectiveness and unlocking new useful properties. Also in the game there is a large selection of weapons and all sorts of ingenious gadgets that can be modified. The hero can carry the things he likes in his inventory, using them as needed. Disco Elysium When your character in Disco Elysium wakes up after a night of heavy drinking, his hangover is so severe that he can't even remember who he is. From now on, it's up to you to decide what kind of disheveled, incapacitated, and flustered detective to be. Unlike many RPGs, Disco Elysium eschews the usual combat and gives all interactions to the power of dialogue. The protagonist's mentality is not entirely stable, and Disco Elysium allows us to develop it and use it while investigating a grim murder case. Original Sin 2. 
This is an RPG in which the influence of the classics of the genre is noticeable. Unlike modern role-playing games, instead of banal options for solving tasks, the game literally draws us into a detailed world. Every decision you make in the game matters and you will have to accept the consequences. Some quests present a really difficult dilemma, especially since you never know what the choice will lead to. Pillars of Eternity This game was developed by the Obsidian Studio, known for its amazing scenarios. Despite the fact that this is a fairly huge game with a lot of variability, everything here was very elaborate. Religion, philosophy, class wars, the world is full of all sorts of crises and conflicts. In each new town and village, you will meet residents who are just waiting for curious adventurers to solve their problems. Here, each quest is able to completely change your idea of morality and affect your reputation. Knights of the Old Republic 2 Here the story does not focus on the opposition between good and evil, the Republic and the Empire. The plot reveals the nature of the Force and what happens if you lose it. This is a story about people and betrayal, which is somewhat reminiscent of Plan Escape. The story uses grey morality. You control an exile who must think through his every move, seeing how the best decisions can lead to greater evil. All this leads to the fact that over time you become much more pragmatic. This is a dark, depressing tale of personal experiences and exploration of the galaxy. Mass Effect Another great RPG series from the company behind Dragon Age. Mass Effect is set in the future, and the player assumes the role of Captain Shepard, who seeks to save the galaxy from a Reaper invasion. We have to upgrade the hero, travel between planets, and recruit a team of various fighters. The storytelling in the game is interactive, and therefore, after a short time, you will begin to seriously worry about your team members and realize that your actions can affect the entire galaxy. Skyrim it's not just one of the best RPGs on PC, it's a continuation of a cult franchise that continues to delight. The game managed to stand the test of time, so after the release in 2011, it still remains relevant, encouraging replay. Skyrim is remembered for its indescribable atmosphere of adventure, and it does not matter what you are doing, fighting giant dragons, or just exploring the open world, while doing alchemy and other crafts. Skyrim is really interesting to explore, because here you can look under almost every stone. Tyranny Dark fantasy from Obsidian Entertainment, in which evil still prevailed and rules the world. The main highlight of the game is that in your charge is not a hero in the traditional sense, but a real executioner sent to decide the fate of the wards of the Lord of Evil. The game was created on the Pillars of Eternity engine and uses an almost classic role-playing model, replete with an abundance of high-quality texts, characters and frisky plot twists, many of which we will do. Risen While Piranha Bytes earned their fame with the Gothic series, these aren't their only successful titles. If you like these guys' approach to RPGs, then try Risen, another interesting project of theirs that introduced a completely different fantasy world. And gamers fell in love with him for an excellent storyline, unique atmosphere, variability in passing quests, and verified mechanics of the genre, which became the Piranha Chip. Persona. Without exaggeration, the legendary JRPG series, which is literally extolled at home. Persona is not only games, but also anime, manga and books that expand the universe. Previously, the series was exclusive to the PlayStation, but not so long ago, some parts of it came out on PC. The games are notable in that they tell stories of teenagers with the ability to summon spirits for help. The plots at first seem childish, but the scriptwriters deftly twist the plot so that adults fall into thought for a long time. That's all thanks for watching, Image Game Channel was with you, have a good day.